Right now, Dennis Kozlowski going against Mashito Kanihara. Tell us about both these guys. Dennis Kozlowski is one of America's greatest wrestlers. He won the silver medal at Barcelona in amateur wrestling. He's going to head up the American Olympic team in Atlanta. This guy is a brilliant wrestler. He's got all the moves. If there's any weakness he has, again, it's facing the kicks and hits of the UWFI style. But pound for pound, one of the greatest wrestlers you've ever seen. Has Dennis lost any matches in Japan so far? Yes, he has, and basically he's lost them because of the inability to defend against the kick. Tonight, he's up against an absolutely superb hitter and kicker, Masahito Kakihara. And we're looking at Takehara walking around the ring right now. He is a very, very popular young man. Here he comes, though. The man we just saw the highlight tape on, Kozlowski. He's also extremely popular here in Japan, and he runs out. He's a silver medalist at Barcelona. He's going for the gold in Atlanta. And he right now is with us with shoot wrestling in Osaka. This ought to be a great match, Gene. I'm looking forward to it. Kakihara takes a bow and the crowd applauds. He'll be in the blue ring. And in the red corner is Dennis Kozlowski. I like to call him Captain America with that outfit that he's gone. <laughs> yes, he's uh, all American, wouldn't you say? He absolutely is, and he's some kind of classic wrestler. But today he goes up against a classic UWFI striking fighter. Kakihara relies heavily on incredibly quick hands, slaps, and powerful kicks. Captain America, he's going to have to stop that. If he wants to use his great wrestling ability, he's going to have to get in tight on this boy, take him to the mat, and get away from that hitting. Where well, there you see it right now. Dennis has to stick on him like flypaper. Otherwise, he's going to be taking the brunt of those kicks and, and punches. And Dennis is uh, continuing to push him to the ropes. Now he brings him down, but it doesn't take long for Kakehara to get out of that one. Well, that's it. Now, Kakihara comes in at 205 pounds against Dennis's 255 pounds. 50 pounds of this kind of fighter is a lot to put up with. If Dennis keeps him on the mat and real close, I, I got to say Dennis is going to take this because uh, of the weight and experience advantage. However, every time they get him up and the referee breaks them, then that's going to be Kakihara's game. It's up to uh, Dennis with his ring savvy to do it. Personally, I think he'll be able to do it. We'll have to wait and see what happens. Anything can happen in these matches. And they do. There's a lot of respect here in Japan for shoot wrestling. And uh, one of the things that people like is the purest form of it. It's almost like sumo in the sense that uh, they know that what's happening in that ring is actually happening. It's not rehearsed. It's not something that uh, they've agreed on before. These guys draw blood. They're really drawing blood. And right now, they're really slapping each other around as Dennis goes after Mashihito. Well, what you're saying is what we're seeing. This is a true sporting contest. I've asked a lot of the American guys, what do you do this? You could earn, you know, say money in, in, in other places, wrestling the other style. What are you doing this for? They put it to a point of pride. They say, we are athletes. We don't want to be considered other than athletes. We are coming in here showing our skill, our athletic ability, our conditioning. It's a matter of pride to these guys. They're going to give it 110%. Now, Gene, tell us, what does it take to qualify to be a UWFI wrestler? Well, you want to get into this organization, they first test out your conditioning. They will ask you to do 1,000 sit-ups, 1,000 push-ups, 1,000 deep knee bends without stop. Then they'll ask you to run about five miles, probably do a few wind sprints. If you can do all that without stopping, they'll think about letting you get in the ring and show them what, they, what you've got. I love to listen to you tell about that. It's almost unbelievable. I know a lot of people can't believe that these guys have to go through that kind of qualification just to earn the right to get in there. But you can see it. They're in excellent condition. These guys are really going after each other. This is what shoot wrestling's all about. Makes the Marine boot camp look like vacation. I've been to the gym a number of times and watched these boys. It's incredible. But you're seeing what I told you. Dennis is, he knows that he can't stay out there and trade hits with him. He constantly moves in. Oh, what a hit to the leg. Dennis felt that one. He's not gonna, you cannot take too many hits to the leg like that. 
Well, so far, neither wrestler has lost any points. They're tied 15-15, so both of them are going after it. It looks like someone's going to have to give way somewhere because uh, points so far hasn't entered into this. Dennis better not make the mistake uh, that a lot of uh, American wrestlers do by crouching down too low in a wrestling position and coming straight in, because that can catch a knee to the head. So far, he's defending well, but he is gonna, he, what, he's, what is vulnerable is his left leg. He's sticking a left leg way out, and Kakihara keeps hitting it. He's trying to get into a position for a throw, but right now, Kakihara has been able to defend it fairly well. Let's see if uh, Dennis can uh, reposition and get Kakehara down. And he does it. And he does it. He brings it That's down. That's a knockdown. Very hard. They'll call out a knockdown. Right on the back of the head. Uh, yes, There's they that do. 50, it. There's that 50 pounds I was talking about. He just reversed Kakehara purely on weight and strength. Put him and down in his head. And he took him down. And now the score is 15 to 11 in favor of Dennis Kozlowski. And now. Kakihara is going to have to start coming back and make up those lost points. That's going to take a lot of zip off Kakihara's hits and kicks, though. You take a hit like that, it's going to slow you down for a while, and that's all Dennis does. Look at some of these moves. These moves are ingenious, these reverses and backs. Now Dennis reaches for the ropes and loses his first point. It's 14-11, and it looks like uh, Dennis is taking a long time to get up. Who said, give me a lever and I can move the world? That's what you're seeing. You're seeing leveraged moves. These guys turn and twist from one hold into another. It's not just a matter of strength and bull power. You're seeing real conditioned athletes with skill. Gene, does it mean a lot to the Japanese audience watching here tonight that, that we're looking at a Olympic medalist. I think it absolutely does, and it certainly makes them happy if the Japanese can beat them because they're saying, look, here's one of America's best wrestlers, and here's what one of our guys can do against them. However, let me say this. Dennis has won over the hearts of a lot of Japanese. He's been here a number of times. He puts on a match. He never quits. He puts all his heart and guts into it. So the Japanese have learned to appreciate him as well. Great, we're five minutes into the match, and right now it's 14 to 11 in favor of Dennis Kozlowski. And the match is slowing down, the intensity is slowing down as both men now are, are trying to find something on the other, trying to find a weakness as they roll into the ropes. Well, Dennis wants to keep this fight on the mat. He does not like it when they break him because if they break him, this is when, see all the cameramen are getting all ready. They're waiting to see Kakiara come in with those slamming punches and kicks. And he does. Oh, oh. tries us, but he didn't hit. Dennis ducked it. Oh, that gra it grazed. Oh, oh no. Oh, oh, it's a knockdown. It's oh, a knockdown. Right on. It's a knockdown. And the score is tied right now, 11-11. We saw it happen. But Dennis is in big trouble. That landed right on the numbers. And here he comes with a flying kick, but Dennis is able to avoid it. And now he's back in, but he's still stunned. You can tell that Dennis no, is stunned. he's stunt. hurting. Dennis is hurting. He needs some time to clear the cobwebs out. And Kagara's not going to give him that if he can. Uh-oh, Kagara's got a he's suplex. He's trying suplex on coming. Can, can he, he do, do it? it? Yes. Oh, no, no. Not quite. A twisting throw, and he gets him down on the mat. Oh. Give Dennis that experience and that Olympic background. He knew what was coming and twisted out on the last minute. That could have been a bad one. Right now, some pressure being put on Dennis Kozlowski's uh, ankle. I know it hurts a lot, and he's in the center of the ring as he now begins to try to crawl for the side. The referee is pointing his finger, asking him if he's ready to give up, but Dennis is able to grunt and groan and get over to the side, and the crowd gives him a big round of applause. You may not know this, but in addition to being an Olympic medalist, Dennis Kozlowski is also a chiropractor. Oh, he probably needs to. Uh, oh, he's going to need one tomorrow. Yeah. yeah, maybe. What does he do? Look in the mirror? <laughs> there we go. Now Dennis gets him down again. And he's putting a lot of pressure on the side of his head. But again, Kakehara is able to roll out of it. We're almost able to whisper here because the crowd is so quiet, so there. intense watching this exciting match. Shoot wrestling. Look out. He's got a great leg extension. Look at the flexibility you need to be able to take that. He's putting enormous pressure on the legs. He's got them totally wide split. Kakiara's out of it, but 
Now you see what kind of stretching they, remember I told you about the stretching exercises, what kind of flexibility these boys need. I mean, you try that at home, uh, you're going to be having a little problem uh, driving your car next uh, tomorrow. Now he's got Dennis in trouble, and Dennis is trying to work his way over so he nope. can reach over to those ropes, but now Dennis reverses. And uh, uh, trying he's to get the arm bar. He's, he's going, going for the arm bar. He certainly is. Very, very exciting right now. What we're seeing is shoot wrestling at its best. And Kakiara couldn't take it, and he swings around. Loses a point. It's 10 to 10. It's 10 to 10 right now. Both men going at each other very hard. We're okay, seeing some excellent wrestling. They both slowed down. Oh, he caught one right to the inside of the leg. And now, the, whether it was to the inside of the leg or to the groin area, I'm not sure. What is tapping him on the back, uh, which usually means that maybe he was a little closer to the groin than he should have been. Is that a warning? Did he go over there and warn the... Uh, yes, he's Kakihara. gone over and warned him. Kakihara, it was a mistake. Well, they're not going to deduct any points. I see. He said, I'm sorry. Dennis said, okay. And now Dennis will probably try to take something uh, back on him. Oh, a very good kick to the leg. He you goes see? after it again. Well, no, Kakihara's trying to kick to the inside of the leg. If you feel your leg, the inside of the leg is much more tender than the outside. And right. Kakihara's found that open. Whoa. Kakihara that was falls slip. outside. It's a slip, but uh, I tell you, both men are going at each other, swinging. See, what, what's happening is Kozlowski's sticking that left leg out so far that he can hit him either to the inside or the outside of the leg. And so he's been catching him to the inside. Oh, what a kick to the ribs. That hurt. But that's it. He's never going to get out of that one. And it doesn't take long as Dennis Kozlowski gets Kakihara into a grab, and he does it. And now Dennis is jumping around the ring. Is he excited? And the fans come alive. They love it. They love him. And right now, Kakehara is on the floor. He's in big trouble. Maybe Dennis ought to go over and give him a little help with his chiropractic service, huh? Hey, take nothing <laughs> against Kakehara. He gave away 40 pounds and put on a brilliant fight. But today, Captain America had a little too much. He showed him that. Ex he All right, now let's go back and take a look at some of this. There we go. Watch Kozlowski get kicked to the face. Here it goes. Slow motion, fans back in the USA, have you ever seen slow motion in professional wrestling? You're seeing it the first time tonight. And here's the end of the now, fight. Kakihara tries to go for a head kick, but Dennis catches it. He's got both legs now firmly caught, just turns around, steps over. He goes far enough, he'll break the back. And Dennis Kozlowski does it, he wins it. Mashihito Kakihara goes down to the American. A great match here in Osaka. The UWF Junior League features a visiting star from the United States, 